Good evening, Joe and Dave here, Wine TV episode two. Hey, uh, how you doing? Testing the Saltram number one. Shiraz. Shiraz from Barossa Valley, yes. uh, one of our favourite wine regions of Australia. Yeah, it's, um, what it was, these guys have been going for a good 150 years or so now, the yeah. Saltram guys. So they've and, been around the block. A yeah. Times, yeah. We have to, um, there's no women with us today, as you can see, this is uh, kind of a boys drink and Frankly, the women went away, so we decided to not stick to our budget and uh, go and get a, a, a decent bottle of wine um, that is a little bit higher priced, I suppose, than what uh, we'd usually sort of be presenting on, on this. Um, but being Valentine's Day, having special events coming up, I, you know, if you really want to impress someone, it's uh, this not that a we great did. drop. No, we just decided we wanted to drink it, really, didn't yes. we? Yeah, yeah. So um, this is actually a 2003 uh, Saltram Number One, which um, retails uh, above sort of above fifty dollars. But uh, uh, Saltram do make uh, uh, Mambro Brook, um, which is an excellent wine as maker well. selection that are, that are really, really, really top wines yeah. that are that are under that. But um, as I said, this is a this is a bit special. This one. Bit of bling on the side there. Yeah. It's a Barossa Valley really... wine show. There you go. There you go. So the Barossa Valley thought that this Barossa Valley wine was pretty good. Yep. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> but um, so we, we've had a couple of glasses, as you can probably tell. Yep. And um, you know, I'm so impressed with this wine. It's it's really amazing, and and a really good example of of Barossa Valley. Valley Floor Shiraz. Full bodied. Uh, you know, like it's warm. I mean, on the nose, definitely it's just got. It smells warm on the nose. It's. Like good fruit, not over fruity, but a really good amount of fruit. Like a good spice, but but not a pepper spice, more like an aniseed or. Licorice or something. Licorice, something, yeah, yeah, that's in there. That's, um, you know, and I really sort of. I, I get like a. Like a a red cordial or like a, a sweetened sort of yeah. black currant or something lots in there. Of sugar. You know, really deli like it just makes you want to dig in straight away. Mm. So I mean, on the taste, wow. I mean that that's a good wine, really. Yeah. I mean, there's not much more to say. That that's that's a good wine. We could probably leave it at that, though. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so yeah, everyone, good wine. Special occasion. Salsa number one. Grab Special it. occasion. Just or oh, the girls gone away. You know. Yeah. yeah. It's great. The girls gone away. Boys want a good drink. Just drink it. It's great. Mm. I mean, put it with some some beef or lamb, which we're going to have soon. Mm -hmm. And um, it, it's perfect. I mean, it's it's rich. It's got good tannin. It's not over tannin. And at least that I think you were saying it's like a almost like a, the aftertaste is like a really good scotch. Yeah. It just. Yeah, it's fantastic. So, um, absolutely fantastic. Great wine, really mature. This is a 2003. I think the latest vintage is an 06. Um, I'm sure it's pretty good too. Either way, it does retail a bit highly. This is about seventy dollars, sixty nine, seventy dollars. But you know, if you put put your dollars away for a couple of months and you want something really special for a good time, mm -hmm. highly recommend it. Excellent. Thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you soon. Cheers. Cheers.